another edition of Real Estate Uncensored. My name is Chuck Fazio. This is my beautiful wife, Angela. We are the owner's broker of West USA Realty Revelation. Today is 29th. Wednesday, June 29th. Um, today I want to start off and talk about passion. Um, guys, passion is not a luxury in your business. It's a necessity. Loving what you do is a non-negotiable necessity for reaching your greatest potential. A career worth loving is not an indulgence, it's not a privilege or a fluke, it's a choice. Guys, you got a passion for what you do. And you know what? And you're not automatically entitled to reach the top of the professional food chain just because you exist. I, I've been seeing a lot of that lately. Every day. Entitlement. The sense of entitlement is just is just driving me crazy. Um, work for it, guys. Have a passion for what you do. You do have the opportunity to get to the top if you just drive towards it and have a passion uh, for your career. Um, and guys, in a world that most products or people are the same, what's going to separate you from each and every one of the people out there is the passion that you have for what you do. Because not many people have it. Yeah, because it is something that will set you apart. You know, prime example, people always said to us, you know, why do you tell everybody what you guys do or what makes you successful? Because no one will do it. Well, no not one will do it. People. And no one has the passion that we have about what we do and how much we love it. Guys, you know, a career is meant to be loved. You need to, you need to love what you do. Um, I always say passion is not the frosting on that cupcake. It's the cupcake. It's the whole cupcake. And you can't have passion as just a feeling because passion drives action. It's right. not really passion if there's no action behind it. Yeah, and uh, guys, that, that's, that's my thought for today. Have a little bit of passion for what you do. Just to show you the passion that I have, I have so much passion for my company and their success that I challenged my agents two months ago to close 425 transactions or I will dress like a woman. Um, if they do. If they do. Yeah. And they did. Actually, it wasn't just 425. So far, it's over 500. Over 500 and we still transactions have two more transaction in two months. Days. That's right. We get, we get an office that's killing it over here. And, nice. And, and now I'll be dressing like a woman tomorrow. Tomorrow. So will John Sherwood, yep. my team leader. And Todd Menard. And our managing broker, Todd Menard, us three lovely ladies. So, beautiful. you got to be there. So how do you get to see these beautiful ladies? Two ways of viewing us. <laughs> <laughs> One will be the runway event. At, at 11.30. 11.30 tomorrow. At the resort. At Sunbird, at our, it's our quarterly office luncheon. All realtors are invited to come. There's going to be great food there. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a fun time. Guys, I really recommend you get to see what we do and, and how uh, the and passion that our, that our company has. And you get to celebrate with us. And celebrate. Good deal. And then that afternoon, tomorrow afternoon at Oregano's in Chandler on Dobson and Jermaine. At 4.30. From 4.30 to 6.30, uh, the happy hour, free food, drinks. And a charity fun event. Giveaways, it is a charity event. You will be able to take pictures with us lovely ladies. And- um, For a for, dollar. For a buck. A dollar a picture. That's forget a about it. You, you, you can't get a better deal taking a, a picture with um, the hottest women in Chandler for tomorrow. Do you notice that I have a ponytail today? Because every time I look at you, it wags. I almost got hit with it. It's because I'm getting my hair done today, praise the Lord. Well, I forgot about that. <laughs> I mean, she's gone all day. It's not all day. Good <laughs> luck. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> what else you want to talk about, honey? Um, renters, right. you said. Yeah, I want to talk about working with renters. Working with renters in today's market is a great way to make some money, like significant money, if you do it right. But we have a few pointers for you. Um, first, we recommend that you take a retainer fee up front because it costs money to drive people around. And renters. We have a form for you to do, do. that, guys. We created it. Yes, just you ask do. Todd. Todd has it. Um, we'll get it up in short clothes soon. But you can actually charge your tenants some money. It has to be made out to West USA Realty Revelation. We have to process it for you. No cash. 
No cash. No cash. cash under the table. Not on the low down. Nobody could slip Nothing me. Nothing on the low Nobody down. Nobody could slip me a fitty. <laughs> <laughs> You can slip me a fitty. <laughs> but that'll help pay for your gas. And renters who are willing to pay that will stick with you and not just flake out on you. Um, that's one thing. And, that's and it's a good way when people say I don't make money doing renters. That's how you make money. They're paying it out there. They're hiring you. You're a professional. Have passion for what you do. <laughs> Scary. Ooh. And then also another the pointer. Another remember point bubbles? Remember bubbles? <laughs> Remember, um, remember bubbles? Okay, so the second thing is is paperwork because it's you never know how the, the landlord or the tenants, I mean the landlord side is going to handle paperwork. Ask up front, am I going to be named on the lease? Because if you're named on the lease, you need to turn in the lease, the A106, the agency, possibly a pool disclosure. So ask up front. Tell them up front you're going to want a copy of that lease. Because even if you're not on the lease, we may ask you for that lease to show that you're not on the lease to be compliant with the department. So just be proactive in the paperwork. Yeah, and and if you're at our office, we have a lot of rental leads. Tons, tons of them. We need um, you. We have a lot of leads. Period. Our boy, our lead generating system. I have a third thing about renters. I, I thought she was going to give me a karate chop. <laughs> it was the three fingers of death. The Angela three finger of death. Um, the prey man. You're going to make. Ooh, I love prey man. They're so cute. Have you seen them? All up right. Hey, I thought you were going to say something. I have a third thing. <laughs> I'm sure I do. Third thing about rent. Oh, new um, spuds. smoke. I know. Did Come on. Ponytail? Sp um, spuds are coming out for rentals. Yay. Okay, so that's going to start to be, um, I, I think in the end of July or something, that's going to start to be a requirement because of our AAR form that's coming and for out. For those people who rentals. are not realtors listening, it's not a potato. Not a great a potato. Yeah. Oh, she's full of jokes. <laughs> okay, onward. Onward. Um, just a little kudos to some of our agents, mm -hmm. uh, Melissa Huerta. She's kicking butt. Oh my gosh. You talk about passion. And she's pretty. Yeah. All right. She's pretty. She's got really nice hair. Boy, that's, that's passion. <laughs> Doing great. Christine Hallwell running a fantastic team. Uh -huh, and she's having pretty. Having passion for a business. Maybe that's the common theme. And Nancy Campbell. Uh, yeah, there you go. She's There's pretty. the common theme. All doing great. Everybody's doing great. A lot of passion out there. Um, well, Nancy Campbell went the extra mile for her client and for her business and for herself, and she did what it had to, what what she had to do to get a couple things done above and beyond. She did a great job. Good job, Nancy Campbell. You get the work done. That that's uh, excellent. Uh, also, talking about passion, um, driving our company. You know, when we set out six years ago, uh, we set out to be the number one brokerage. You know, people kind of laughed. A little was, bit mad. But anyway, um, we are the number one brokerage of production in the Southeast Valley. For almost two years. And the Phoenix Business Journal just posted we are one of the top ten brokerages in the entire valley. Um, hip, hip. Jorge. Hip, hip. <laughs> so, um, awesome job, guys. The Ruts made the top 50 agents, and so did Henry Wang from our office. Yes, congratulations. Um, driving the company. Uh, you know, West USA Realty, our parent company, number one brokerage in the Valley. Valley number one. Um, even though they have thousands of agents, and we don't, and but we're up there in the top ten. Thanks, guys. Um, great job, great job out there. Uh, would like to thank our sponsors mm -hmm. this week. Is there anything else you want to add? Probably. Um, I know last week we forgot to announce our winners was uh, Nicole and Curtis Miller. Yeah. They did a great job, but as my niece and nephew, so uh, they got their gift certificates. Because they watch us. If you guess where we are this week, $25 gift certificate. Come on, guys. I'm, I'm looking to give out some money. Um, once again, don't forget tomorrow. Be our there. office meeting at 1130, food, fun, and then the happy hour at Oregano's in the afternoon. If you have any questions, I um, would like to know where it is, you can give us a call, 480 Five seven zero eight zero two zero. I'm like Glenn Beck. Yeah. Call yeah. me. <laughs> Glenn Beck, if you're watching. That's Thank you to our sponsors, Magnus Title, uh, Yvette Meyer Old Republic, uh -huh. Deb LaPierre Academy Mortgage, Christine Lee, Christine Lee, Lee. and uh, April Gerdes over at Mortgage Advantage. Bob Keister. Bob Keister, Gold Key Inspection. So thanks, guys. We will see you next week. Have a great day and God, God bless, bless you. you.